Welcome to more Gran Turismo Sports Special Titan. Today we have 12 to 2000 GTs around Lago McGlure Airplane Circuit. I can't remember which one's which and all that. There's like eight of them now, but it's it's the one that looked like an airplane or shark or whatever. Kind of sort of both. Actually, I feel like shark circuit sounds more cool than airplane circuit. So I think I'm going to call it the shark circuit. Yeah. Lago Maglore shark circuit. Also, it seems kind of odd, too, that this uses Lago even though I'm an American. Americans don't use Lago. We just say lake, but whatever. I'm pretty sure in other countries, too, it actually shows us as lake. That's just not a default. It always says Lago, either. So, yeah, that's weird. But anyway... What's not weird is the racing. The racing is good. Kind of. Could be worse. It's not really side by side or anything yet, but it ain't bad. The leader for this race qualified like eight tenths of a second faster than me, and second qualified about two tenths of a second faster than me. So, second is realistically all I'm gonna get, but I mean, whatever. I'm not all that good with these cars, really. I know I've said before that I'm better with the slower cars, and these are relatively slow. They're in 100s, but these are really about as fast and as hard to drive as in 100s get. They're old, and power to rate ratio is the equivalent of like a Lotus Elise or something like that. I assume that would be roughly the same. And those are relatively hard to drive to the max. These are relatively hard to drive to the max. They're not the hardest thing in the world, but I'm not the best at them, so... Yeah, I'm probably not going to win this one, even though, wink wink, I actually did win another one, but that one actually was kind of a... The leader just messed up immediately, and I kind of ran away with it, so... It's not really worth showing, but this one I'll keep a secret whether I win or not. I don't know, everyone's kind of sort of messing up, though. This was before the race I won, so I wasn't quite as good here yet. So, it's kind of sort of looking like everybody wasn't quite as good as here yet, except for the leader. The leader's gone on a half, but actually, I'm right in a battle, though, so I need to be pretty careful. I'm not really gone from anyone yet. I'm pretty caught in picking close to second, and fourth is really caught in picking close to me. So, this could go a lot of ways, except for first, but anything beyond first, well, maybe I can still get... And I don't know, first might be a possibility, but given that I get a win later, eh, not all that big of a deal. I'm already one spot higher than I was previously when I qualified, so it's not a loss. And fourth is slowly losing speed to me, slowly, very slowly. I probably only lost like half a second the whole lap, but I am slowly gaining on second. If it's this one slowly, probably also only about half a second. So this looks like the... Okay then. First was gone and a half, but somehow second's actually getting on first, even though first qualified almost... Like, or I think even more than half a second faster than second, so... That's interesting. I mean, first isn't really my problem yet. And honestly, if I start racing with second, which I'm probably going to do, that means first probably will end up getting gone truly and really... So, I mean, I could try to let second run their own lines and stuff, but realistically, this is kind of a short race, so I'll probably just need to try to pass it any chance I get. So unless first messes up or goes really cop pick it solid. Jiminy Cricket, why is this a race for first now? I mean, that's a good thing, but I really don't feel like it should be. First isn't even really messing up or anything. It's first does this downright driving slower, and while well, second did mess up trying to either not get past by me or past first or whatever but yeah I mean that, there you go and now there's lap traffic too so this is going to be real comp picking interesting at this point with everybody being B A S and then everyone S sportsmanship I'd hope the lap traffic's nice but <laughs> first place wasn't the nicest in the world there I mean the lap traffic wasn't done right in the way there so pretty much first ain't going to get a positive S or because Lap traffic was there. I still feel like lap traffic should just plain be ghost. Because realistically, 
they're that far off on this short of course they wouldn't be in the same race as people that in the top dead anyway so those who wouldn't be able to make the race in real life should go ghost given that this is supposed to be a realistic game I mean obviously you can have perfect matchmaking every time but when those times it ain't quite as good it should be ghost but in any way whatever it wasn't a perfect race for anyone but I managed to gain two positions during it and Honestly, through all that lap traffic stuff, I saw first being kind of aggressive with the lap traffic, so I didn't really know what first would do with me. And realistically, the only way I was really going to get there would be a borderline dive bomb. One of those where I wasn't necessarily going to downright not make the turn, but it'd be one of those where I'm going like 10 miles an hour through the turn to be able to make it, so... Yeah, risk versus reward didn't seem worth it, and really, second's relatively rewarding if you start in fourth, so I'll take it. Decent race... Decent finish, can't really complain, and that is indeed Andy Worth, the Yeehaw.